Okay, so this is our camera, and we used a coffee can. So we had to make sure it was really light tight. So we, at first, we spray painted the lid, but we noticed that light was still going through. So we went in with um, foil paper instead, and this just really helped avoid any more light entering the, the inside of the camera. And we also created this piece of tape stand that would hold the ribbon to make sure it was easy for these people with limited dexterity to open the camera. So it's really just like, you just pull it off easily. And we created our shutter using a piece of aluminum can and this piece of chipboard. And we just taped out the edges to make sure it was easy for this to move and slide. And we also created this pedestal thing to make sure our camera was stabilized and would capture a nice uh, picture without any, uh, you know, make sure it wasn't tilted or anything. And that's why we also added these tape strips so we can make sure that whenever we inserted the film, it was nice and straight. And that is everything. All right, so to load the film paper for our camera, you remove the lid by pulling on the handles and take into consideration the strips that show you where to place the film paper on the inside of the lid. So you stick the film paper to this little piece of tape on top of the ribbons, tucking in the corners inside the lid to make sure they don't get exposed to any light and close the lid onto the can. So these are our final products. Here you can really see the clarity that our camera captures. Although we had a little bit of developing um, issues, you can really see how well it takes pictures. And then this one, um, it demonstrates how it can fit large objects into its frame. Although we did have a little bit of a blur in the image